Dear students, let me describe the value or importance of coral reefs. They are tourist attraction, but you have to remind the meaning of tourist. Tourist is the person who can move from one place to another for purposes of leisure, studies, or for business. Therefore, most of the people is just going to these areas so as to observe or to study or to determine the formation because the, this material is just formed due to the limestone or calcium carbonate. Yeah? This material is soft in nature. Therefore, most of the people who have not yet to observe this organism can go to that area and uh, to make enjoyment as a tourist. Another, there are low materials for cement industry. Dear students, for instance, in Tanga is nearby to, to ta uh, Tanga is nearby to Membuasa. Therefore, even at Tanga there is the industry which is just producing cement. Therefore, these materials or corals is very potential as the raw materials for making cement. Wherever this material will be added with a certain chemical, we obtain cement which is just using for building. They are providing a breeding for fishing and hence lead to the development of fishing industry. Dear students, along this coral reefs, there is some organism, for instance, polyps, or planktons. Therefore, this material is just consumed with the creatures like fish within water bodies. Wherever this fish will be consuming this organism, therefore, will be healthy and to grow in good ways, which can be taken to the industry and uh, to make more breeding for fish. Or it's just taking as uh, a breeding for fish. Wherever this fish will be growing or will be healthy, it can be consumed with uh, different people for different purposes. Not only that, but also it is very useful because it just protects the coast against wave destruction from island. For instance, this material is just taking place within water bodies, not far away from the coast. Therefore, it can be growing within water bodies at the landmass of island. Or as in most of the people in Tanzania is called island, but for those who are linguistic, call it island. Therefore, this protects the coast against wave dissertion formation of island. For instance, wherever the waves or shwash is stronger, and uh, these waves or this shwash is going to make dissertion to the coast. Wherever we'll be mating with this, uh, this coral polyps or with this coral leaves, therefore, this will be acting as the wind breakers. Even the dissertion of the coast will be impossible. Another the source is a source of income to people as some people call them and sell to the con contractors. Dear, stu uh, dear students, most of these materials, there are some people who are uh, just engaging as the, are the activities or as the economic activities whereby the people is just collecting this material and uh, to sell to those people who want this material, especially the contractors of different buildings. Not only that, but also this coral reefs is very essential or important because they provide stone for building as well as for bridge construction, as we have been observed. Not only that, but also this, or, or, uh, this coral reefs, they are used for Declaration are the sum of the coral attached to the wall of a house by cement and they become attractive. Eh? For those who have been observed, and I will show you, eh? and you have to observe this structure like what is Jesse or shown on, the, on this structure. Dear students, problem posed by coral in the word for problem caused by coral in the word. They hinder navigation in the ocean. Remind yourself that wherever this material will be taking place within water bodies, for instance, to the island, after this material to, un to, un to, to undergo death, therefore, it can be changing from polyps as the organism to the coral which is a limestone rock. Wherever this limestone rock will be heated with, the, with, the, what, with marine vessels like ship, or kennels, therefore, even this, uh, this situation will be impossible. 
to exist because it will be decided. Therefore, it's just hindered navigation in the, in the ocean. They hinder the formation of some attractive coastal features since they prevent the waves, the waves. Uh, you have to remind yourself that because it's just taking place within water bodies, you have to remind you there are some waves or currents from the middle of the ocean which can sweep some materials and it will deposit on the landmass or to the coast. Those material deposition materials is called the beaches. But you have to remind yourself that most of the people or tourists is going to a certain place so as to observe the coast. But the area whereby this coral is present, even the breaches will be impossible to be, uh, to be formed because some of them have been uh, attained or uh, ob obstructed before to reach to the, to the coast. Another problem they provide stony for, uh, another problem is they encourage the development or growth of water. They encourage the development or growth of water widths in the ocean. Water widths, these are materials which can be growing on the water bodies. In Swahili, wanauta magugumaji. Because this material, after two, take place is some organisms can be growing easily. For instance, this is we water weeds. Not only that, but also the problem which can be facing these coral all over the world is they are source of water pollution in the sea, especially quarrying process. Wherever, for instance, for those people who are just collecting this material for selling to different people, for instance, con contractors, therefore, the process for taking or collecting can cause for spreading this material and the cause for the pollution. Because pollution, this is just the addition of unwanted material in a particular area. For instance, here is the water pollution. Another problem is they discourage the, uh, divers from uh, surveying or swimming deeply. Eh? What do you garage? Eh? Those people who are just diver within water bodies can be fearing for to, t to, to attack or to hit to this uh, ransom rock because wherever you hit it, even yourself will be injured. Another problem is make a decision of sea moving vessels and make Inca cost in repairing them. You have to remind that wherever the uh, water vessels like shape will be passing through to this area. After to hit it, after heating, it can be distracted, which can inca cost to the people or to the owner for repairing these vessels. Dear students, let's describe problem facing growth in developing tropical leaves. Water pollution means by acidic rain. For instance, this corolipsy or polypsy is one to grow, but what are factors that can cause for this organism to not to exist or to reach to maturity? One is pollution, water pollution, made by acid rain, which may change the minerals composition of coral reefs and they become soluble in nature. Another is presence of mats and other aerobic materials created by river hindrances in their development. Uh, you have to remind yourself that this organism is just taking place to the ocean. But ocean, it can be drained its water from different rivers. But you have to remind yourself, the river, it can be eroded some materials and it will deposit within the water, water bodies of, to, to, to pour to the ocean, which can cause for the ocean to reduce its, uh, its deepness or can cause this mud or all of your material to deposit to this organism, and this organism will no longer to obtain the, those conditions like sun rays, like uh, oxygen, and others condition. Another the press of my, uh, another problem the condition of fresh water in the ocean from ice melting discourage the growth. You have to remind yourself that this organism is just growing to the area of salty water. But wherever water from made of ice, which is fresh in nature, wherever will be added, it will make the reduction of salt capacity or serene. Therefore, even this organism will no, will no longer to exist because this organism is just living in the salty area.
Another is the presence of storms or destroy of coral reefs deposited. Eh? Like what we have been described with the, the greatest thing as Murray, that uh, before there was a deposition of material at certain places because of uh, strong winds was destroyed that area and the cause for the change from fraging to the atoll. Therefore, strong winds is among of the factor which can avoid these creatures to reach to the maturity. Another uh, problem is the human influence through quarry of the coral reefs linked also to develop. For instance, the people who are just employing themselves for collecting this organism. Therefore, wherever you are just taking this material so as to sell to the different people like a constructor, therefore, you are just prohibiting or you are just avoiding this material or this organism to reach to the maturity. Okay, another problem is pressure of oil spills from different sources, hinder sunlight penetration of the ocean. For instance, wherever there is a, a certain tanks or tank of oil, is, uh, for instance, ship which is just uh, taking some oil, wherever will be spraying this land to these water bodies, even penetration of sun rays will be impossible because most of sun rays will be absorbing by this. this Oil. Therefore, the sun rays or heating capacity to this organism will, will, will not reach to this polypsy or to this organism. Therefore, even the enrichment to the maturity will be impossible. Dear students, let us describe the importance of coral or for coastal features. Coastal features, because coral leaf is among to the coral features, as of erosive or deposition, or what are features or importance of coastal features, for instance, beaches, for instance, geos, portals, and others, blowholes, not portals, blowholes, geos, beams, and others of the same kind. What is the essential or the, the importance? First, coastal features, for instance, speed, wave cut, plant forms attract tourism, exactly. Here, there is no argument. Because most of the people just go to, to rook it so as to make an enjoyment. Some emergency coastal, especially fjords, or provide city of harbors. Okay, there is some uh, features of coastal which most of the people is making a harbor eh, when I wake up Bandali so as the people can be the place of entrance. Another, the place of lagoons provide fishing grounds. A lagoon this is formed after the cave to be taking place, whereby most of the fish is going to round that area. A, like this structure, which is just shown on the, on the blackboard. Another is the place of, of Tomboro act as a bridge between the landmass and the island, exactly. But you have to remind yourself of the meaning of Tomboro. Tomboro, this is a bar materials which exist from the landmass to the island and it's just actually at the bridge. Therefore, a, a certain person can be moving from this area to another area through this landmass. Or other person can be drain can be moving through boats or ship to destination or to the island. Therefore, this tomboro are the deposition materials because with wave action it can be a person to be moving through or traveling through this uh, deposition of features. Therefore, these features is very essential. Another importance is some features provide the area for settlement. For instance, uh, wave cutting or platforms. Uh, most of people can be settled on that areas. Another importance is uh, place of sands deposited lead to the provision of building materials. Also, people can be the, can be taking some sands so as to be using for different purposes, for example, for building. Problem facing the coastal areas. What are causes or problems that can cause for desertion or facing the coastal areas? But you have to remind yourself the meaning of coastal. Coastal, this is the landmass which is nearby the water bodies. Even in Tanzania, there is the coastal regions. Eh? For instance, Morogoro, Dar es Salaam, Tanga, Mtwara, Rindi, and others. Therefore, what are problems facing these coastal areas? 
First, deforestation done by man on the coastal area for establishing settlement. Because wherever the trees or vegetation which is just growing on that area is acting as the breakers, which can avoid dissection of the landmass or the water bodies or the coast. Another is the land degradation along the coastal influencing by fishermen and the tourists. Uh, land degradation, this is the land dissection for purpose maybe of making settlement or for making a path. Therefore, this is the amount of coastal areas to be dissected. Another is the depo disposing of the waste products on the coastal area. Eh, which is very prohibited and very harm in nature. And is the one of the factors that can act on the problem facing the coastal areas. Another problem facing the coastal areas is the presence of strong waves such as the tsunami, which lead to the devastation or desertion of that coastal areas. Another place of divergence zone along the coast influencing volcanoes which may result in dissection from properties. For instance, wherever the eruption of motor materials will be erupting or take place and the make formation of lavas on the area of along the coast. Therefore, even the coast will be changing from its appearance, maybe from sand to the to the pebbles or to the crust. Another one is the coastal area are also faced by earthquake in the zone of weakness, occurrence of various storms or hurricanes and uh, tornadoes. Uh, I think you know the meaning of hurricane or tornadoes. These are part of atmosphere disturbance. And wherever you want to make or you want to know more about this, you want to know the most. Of, the most. Therefore, you have to refer to the topic of climatology. Eh, which have been described more. How to conserve, how to conserve coastal areas? Because the coastal areas, this is the landmass nearby the coast, and there is just a, a face with a different problem. What are measures or how to conserve these areas? Through planting trees along the coast, because uh, trees or vegetation is just acting as the breakers for different sea, uh, movement, for instance, sea, mud from the highlands, which is just drained with sea, a river, will be attached to the vegetation and avoid the cost to remain as it is. Another is through establishing, through establishing settlement schemes far away from the coastal, so as they, they discourage people from establishing settlement along the coast. Therefore, uh, the amount of the conserv conservation or management of uh, coastal areas is to make people to settle far away from the coastal areas because wherever you be settled nearby, you will make destruction of the coast. Through construction forests, another ways of uh, maintaining or conserving the coastal is to build a big holes which can avoid people to pass through to the coastal areas because the coastal is very essential for the tourists which can maintain or can gain grants or can gain more revenue from these people. Therefore, it should be building a certain world so as to maintain it. Through construction of gardens from for preventing the strong waves. Therefore, here you have to construct a, a certain grains which is right to the horrors which can avoid the strong storms to sweep this coast or to destroy the sweep either through the, the, the tsunami. Through recycling of the material, waste products, because most of the people is just draining or dumping material nearby the coast and they cause for the coast to be distracted. Therefore, the people, for instance, nylon materials, it should be recycling so as to be used for different purposes. For instance, ma, 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 this is the nylon. It should be recycling so as to avoid the people to dump or to, to dump this material nearby the coast, which can cause for more desertion. Another con uh, conservation ways or conserve coastal areas ways is to establish strict policy to prevent people from coastal really Destruction. Here, the government and the people themselves, they have to make 
different laws or policies that can restrict these people to settle or to distract the landmass nearby the coast. Through establishing, another is through establishing of various activities rather than depending on the fishing activities in order to reduce coastal degradation. Therefore, the people who are engaging in fishing activities, fishermen, it should be engaging in another or in alternative activities which can obtain or can gain revenue rather than depending on fishing activities which might cause for the dissertation of this landmass.